What's the difference between young and old forests? Let's talk about it. Right now, I'm standing in an old growth forest. That means this forest has either never been logged or hasn't been logged in over 250 years on the coast. Old growth forests are brimming with life. They have a rich understory filled with plants, a beautiful mix of ages of young and old trees, and are also filled with dead and downed logs that provide food and shelter for many different species. Let's compare that to a young forest. As you can see, this young tree plantation looks completely different from old growth. That's because all these trees are really uniform in age. They're all under 60 years old and are really crammed together. Because no light can easily pierce through the canopy, it results in this really barren understory. It's because of all these factors that make old growth so important and so unique. Old growth forests support far more life than younger forests, and it'll take over a century for young forests to become as productive and as biodiverse as old growth, but we don't have time to wait. Only a small fraction of old growth forests with beautiful big trees like these remain standing in British Columbia, and most is at risk of being logged. Take 60 seconds right now to help ensure these forests remain standing for future generations.